Assalamu alaikum, hello hi everyone, how are you? Welcome to Sister Slabs channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to draw oval shape in scratch. Before I get started, if you like my tutorial, please like, subscribe and share with your friends. Okay, let's get started. Uh, I already made in advance so I, that I can show you how I draw the oval shape. If you want to draw oval shape in a horizontal way, so this is script for that. If you want to draw the vertical way, you'll draw like this. And this one I made a little flower. I'll show you how I did. If you check my tutorial how to draw a circle, it will be easy for you to understand this one so please make sure to check how to draw circle in scratch i will give you the link in description so that it will be easy for you okay for that tutorial two way you can do you either go to scratch.mit.edu and uh, go either you can sign in or online go to create so here you can save your project like oval shape then you can save now since i signed in so it's save on the scratch cloud or you can do that save to your computer or save as a copy whatever you want to you can do it but please try to save your project very often okay first let me quickly show you what you need to do you'll go to the add extension then you go click the pen so for that, as you know, for pen setup, first we have to go to the event section when the green flag is clicked or anything. We learn other blocks, but for now, please, that, that is the basic that everyone use that green flag is clicked. Then we'll set up. It is also unnecessary drawing will be erased pen up so when the pen up the sprites will not draw anything then we'll go to the motion palette definitely we want the sprites in center position if you want any other position you can do it but i prefer the center one then for first we'll do the horizontal wise for that horizontal wise we need the paint in direction 90 degree as you know if we see if we want 180 the direction will be like that if minus 90 the cat will move on that side it's a minus 90 and this is positive 180 if you want to do i mean the zero direction the sprites will move up right position so i want that direction in 90 degrees so it will face up the right side then in the pen blocks we have to set the color any color you want so i'm good on that color and pen size as i told you zero to one to five is the thin and the greater than five will be thick the color of the pen so then I need to set up the pen down. For oval, first we'll do make the round, the left hand side and right hand side. So first I'll show you, as you know, if you do the circle, first let me show you quickly for circle. Move 10 steps counterclockwise. For circle, at, we know that we need 36 times 10 by 10. 
If we repeat 36 times and move 10 steps and turn 10 degrees, it will draw a circle, as you know. So for oval shape, we need the half way down. So for half, we'll do 18, move 10 steps and 10 down that. Then it'll show it's drawing half with the right side then we want to move that sprites go up to the negative x axis so i'll what i'll do i'll change the x by negative 100 okay i'll change the x for negative 100 then you click it see it draw a straight line up to negative 100 then we need to draw the another half circle I mean semicircle or half circle so what we can do we can duplicate this copy because I'm using the same thing so it's draw but here I don't need to, to go to the negative 100 so here I will change the X go to the positive side positive X axis so here I will use the X by positive 100 so oval that's the way you can draw the horizontal wise now first we need to set up the vertical wise simply i will just duplicate this copy just right click and duplicate then what i need to change i want to change the point in direction 180 so what will happen let me leave this first if i click it here it will draw this bottom wise the semicircle then i want to change the position y will go to the positive y so i need to change the y by when the spreads will move up it will i'll change by 100 positive 100 so when i click it it's a semicircle then it's go to up then i need another semicircle so i can just select it this one so when I click it, see how I draw the another semicircle. Now I want to move the change position of y is negative y is negative direction. So I'll use the change y by negative 100 so that it will that left right side was move 100 straight. So I want to move the cat 100 below the vertical wise so if i click it it can draw that the vertical wise now if you want to the beautiful picture if you follow my how to draw the circle same way we'll draw a beautiful flower here so either way you can draw any any anyone using horizontal or vertical the way you want i want the horizontal wise so i'll duplicate this one what I need to repeat it, I have to use the control section here. I'll use the repeat block and what I'll add, I want to add like 36. Okay, let me repeat the 24 times 15 degree turns as I show you in the calculator, you will check 360 because the angle is total 360 any circle or anything divided by if you want to turn 15 degree then how many repeat you need 24 if you want to do like 5 degree turns then you need 32 times so you'll calculate like this okay so i want to turn 15 degrees so i'll take this 24 repeats and i want to turn counterclockwise 15 and i want to change the pen color okay so you will experiment with this then i'll grab all the semicircle codes then like no, after the semicircle code, then we'll change the turn 15 degrees, change the color. Oh, where is my okay? Sorry, I need to set this up in position. Okay, now the script is ready. Now, let's sh sh now I'll show you how it will change when I click it. 
see it will draw a beautiful flower you can see when it will done so you can experiment with different different repetition times and on the different color time if you want to draw any flower every shape you can draw that kind of flower circle shape i show you and this one the semicircle shape i you can get two flowers so even if you want to add more then you can add script so i guess you like that tutorial that so i almost done in this tutorial or oh, another way you can i can show you another since i use this one here one thing you can do like in this one oval you want to change the color so what you can do you can set here the change the color by 10 every turn they will change the color yes so let's see you can do that also oh no mm, i think we have to set this in every turn so that you can change the color so here let's see how it changed this you can yeah like that if you want to set the paint size little bit more and color you want to change like 15 just keep experiment is script so that you can get it i'll give you the link in in my code in this code in the description so please check the description so that's the end of this tutorial i hope you like it so please don't forget to like subscribe and share with your friends thank you so much bye bye